Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, depending on what time you're watching this next episode from me, Avamaz, on the Alpha Craft server. I am actually um, in Abbeville at the moment. You can see the big uh, mob chimney is in the background with a house and the tall twin torches, the bridge, the kelp farm, and all the stuff that we're starting to build. So I've actually built more than I realised. I need to do something more with that bridge. It's still not quite right. But I've not, still not got the mob farm to work. Don't know why. Seriously, I'm trying out some of the ideas that you put in the comments of the last video. Very, very grateful. Let's see if I can't get that to work at some point in the next week. So as by next episode, it is working. But today, we're not spending much time around here. We are going to be going to Spawn because I've got a little project that I'm going to be doing at Spawn that I just want to get sorted. It's sort of a, a bit of an inter-team competition, not competition, more of a... A project for me that I'm doing for the rest of the team to see if we can't improve communications because communications when you're working in a team is absolutely key so this is what we're gonna do I will see you over there so I came to spawn through the never tunnel I thought I would do it just for a change so as I don't wear out mere elytra anymore but we've got to come hang on I've got to work this out so if we've got the alpha over this side, what I don't want to do, I don't want to mess the alpha. Oh, look, the station master has got Wild's head. Wild's head's everywhere, really, isn't it? That's hilarious. But um, obviously, I don't want to mess up the iron alpha, so I need to make sure I'm miles away from the iron alpha, just in case I basically put a door in it. And do you know what? I might, I might get some iron whilst I'm at it, just in case I want to use some iron. I've not got any iron blocks, have I? No, I didn't bring it. So I'm going to get some iron blocks. I've got a shulker full of other materials at the moment. But that is collecting iron like no one's business. The iron outfit is literally, if you've not seen it, go and watch Frill's um, tutorial on the iron alpha. It makes the iron titan and the iron phoenix look like a single village farm, frankly. And apart from anything, it works. It works in 113. No reason to think it won't. Oh, it's so loud. R no reason to think it won't work in 114 whatsoever. It is an absolutely superb farm. Far more simple than those as well, frankly, if you don't mind me saying so. So I'm I'm really sorry, Tango, but your your crown's taken. This thing is the boss. And if you've not seen it, how to make it, go and find out how to make it and get one on your world. Now I don't actually know where we collect the iron from on the iron alpha anymore. There it is. Right, so we've got blocks of iron there. So if I take one, two, three, four, five, six blocks of iron, and I then, obviously if you take some blocks of iron, you need to, well, I've got one left over. Except I can't. Right, so let's pop that there. I want to get some more iron, like that. I'm doing a right old ash job of this, aren't I? So get that like that, and that like that, get that iron, I'm just going to make up a load, I think I'm just going to make up a load of blocks, right, a load of ingots, and when I'm done, I'll be back. So I've got a load of stuff, I've almost certainly not got enough stuff, we all know that I've not got enough stuff, and I'm going to come over here, I think, because I want to be away from the iron alpha, but I don't want to be too far away from the alpha because I want to start to build stuff up that's kind of near the the spawn area. So I'm going to use, I think I'm going to use this area here. Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Where am I going to go? Let me think. So we've got Foex's shop there. Um, oh, I need to decide where this is going to go, don't I? Um, that's Kenny's. You know, I am. I'm going to come over here. I think it's the right spot. So I'm going to take up this spot kind of in the corner-ish and create what is going to be our kind of communications centre. And it's going to allow us all to send each, each other messages and whatnot as long as we come back to spawn to collect them. Because I'm not having any kind of pan server delivery malarkey oh goodness me no because that would be far too many oppers frankly but what i'm going to do is basically a post office i'm going to make a little industrial post office it's not going to be a biggie it's only going to be a little but it's going to be enough for us to have uh, somewhere that we can send each other messages or leave each other little bits and pieces that will be forever in the um 
kind of the spawn station area. So I'm just actually, I'm going to go and have a kip and then I'm going to get cracking. Right, so I'm going to do it here and I'm going to make the front entrance, um, I reckon, here. So let's kind of have a two wide front entrance like that. And then we're going to indent it in and come around this way. I'm just going to do a quick floor plan. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And with the first one, that makes nine. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, then we're going to come in two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't think I've got room to go back nine, have I? One, two, three, four, five, six. If I dig some bits out from here, I might be out of cheat. Hang on, let me just a little bit of terraforming on the fly here. I'm just gonna get some dirt so as I can bulk out. Oh, except I've got too much in my inventory, and I. Right. So if I, what do I want to lose for the time being? Uh, what I could do actually if I put that down there I can get my shulker box down there open that up yeah that's all good if I collect up this dirt and then I can gimme 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 the dirt right collect up a bit more dirt probably not nearly enough yet should have just bought me own dirt, frankly, shouldn't I? That would have been a darn sight easier. Right, and then come up here and build out. So as we've got... So if this comes out, two, three, four, five, six. So it's really only a little bit that I need to build out. But three... I can't have that like that, that looks awful. Right, that there, and that like that. There we go. Right, so if I then carry this on, so that's two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that going to be big enough? Yeah, eight, nine, why not? Nine, oh no, not that one. And then this can come in. Two, three, four, Five, six, seven. Um, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Then it comes right up behind the trees. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. In there. In there. And in like. Do I like that? I'm not sure I like that. This could be a little bit too higgledy piggledy, so I'm just going to bring this in like that. So if I've got that as a footprint, how is that going to look? That's probably okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to dig out all of the base here. Of course, the, oh, except I'm not messing stuff up. There's a cow there. Oh, you poor little fella. Right, so. What I'm going to do, because I want to, I want to replace the floor, but I can't replace the floor. Yeah, I can't replace the floor. So if I put that like that, I'm going to replace the floor with wood for now. I might change this or add to it as I go. I didn't know this was hollow. Who built this up to make? Oh. Oh well, never mind. We'll have to have it empty underneath, won't we? That's just the only thing. It's lit up underneath there, isn't it? So it's not like we're gonna. Hang on, I've got to go underneath now. So it's all lit. We've got a cat. Oh, bless the cow. It's all trapped. Um, so it is all lit. So we are safe enough. So if I then come up like that, I can make a floor without fear of mobs spawning underneath the floor. Which would just be, I mean, it'd be annoying, basically. That's not what I want. Right, so I've got to remember that I don't fall into Avo makes a rustic build mode. Because if that's what happens, it's not going to be in keeping with the um, industrial theme. But I do want a wooden floor, I think. Let's carry on. 
and I've got to work out how am I going to get the storage area and then I'm going to build around it rather than build the building and then do the storage area I think I'm going to do it the other way around I'm going to do the storage area or the the post office area and then I'm going to do the building around it so I'll be back when I've done a little bit more so I've got the basic outline kind of sorted now I'm not really an expert in industrial build i'm looking forward to some of the other areas that we're going to build up because industrial build isn't my forte but we're going to give it a go anyway and i'm going to go kind of in the same style as the the build around the alpha just a little bit because that's kind of trying to keep it in keeping with the surroundings a little bit which is you know fairly important that we try and do that wherever possible the odd bit of light relief every now and again is obviously always good just going to fill that in because that is officially a spawnable block there we go um i reckon two layers of brick is going to be enough i don't want a bit to be too bricky but that's kind of yeah okay we're sort of there and inside i'm just starting to build up what the mailboxes are going to be so it's basically it's a chest I'm going to put a sign on everybody's chest. I've got more chests than we could possibly need. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, thirteen. I can't have thirteen. That won't do at all. Um, quick, panic, panic. Where am I going to put the other one? Ah, uh, I need a fourteen. I'm going to stick it there. Right. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put. No, it can't be there, can it? Can't be there. Oh, unlucky 13. I'm not superstitious. What does it matter? It's fine. It's all good. So now what I'm going to do is I need to basically get these um, signed up. So if I come around here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Look, there's 9 there. That is perfect. So let's get ourselves 9 signs. And we're going to shove this sign on here. Uh, get that like that and we're going to say this is Frilioth's mailbox like that there we go so that's that and then I'm going to go shift onto that get myself I don't know it just looks pretty with all the asterisks on it and this is Jax's mailbox doing this in no particular order I'm just shoving them on. Right, so I'm going to get the signs on and build it up a little bit more, and I'll see you in a minute. Right, so I've just finished blocking around the edges because there was, like, dirt that wasn't the same level as some stone bricks, and it was the same round here. Look, in fact, I've left a bit of dirt there, and none of this was in a straight line, and my teeth were itching so bad. I literally had my mouth open, scratching my teeth because they were so itchy and I had to sort it out. I must get this OCD done one day, for goodness sake. Right, so what I'm now going to do, I just need to detail it up a little bit around the outside so as I give myself a feel for what it is we're doing. I'm just using some iron bars just to give it some texture. Um, obviously, I can't use the same kind of textures that I would normally use to texture something up because... They're more kind of rustic-y, medieval -y type textures. And that's not in keeping with what I'm trying to achieve here. So I'm just going to use these to give a bit more of an industrial feel. Maybe it's iron bars because we don't want any vandals coming along and uh, messing up the post office. Because you know what those vandals are like and coming in post offices. They're all about the post office. Hang on, where's, let's have another one of those. That come there and there. There, there, now, and that's that all the way. Right, so if I come out just to look at it from a bit of a distance, you can see we're starting to get a bit of a feel for what it is we're trying to do. What I now want to do is work out how am I going to roof it? What am I going to do so as it doesn't look like it's kind of out of place? And I'm not entirely sure. I might use... See if we can get some stone brickage first off. If I come out there like that, make a, a gable end, will it work? Let's just see whether that works. 
That might work, you know. It might work. I've just got to get myself back on top here now. Let's get myself up here. Um, it might just work if I do. How do I... Yeah, I think we're all right. Let's have a crack at that. I need to get some more stone brick steps or make some. That will be make some then. Right, so if I can, this is why I brought the crafting table, people, because I knew absolutely that I wasn't going to have enough. Oh, and I'm not going to have enough. To, oh, yeah, I am. Let's make 20 sets of steps like that. I come up here. That can go. No. Oh, I don't know, actually. Happy accident, perhaps? Maybe. Not sure on that one. Have I got any stone slabs? Did I bring any stone slabs? I must have done. Surely I brought some stone brick slabs. Please tell me I bought some stone brick slabs. Oh, for goodness sake. Well, I guess I've got some crafting to do. Yep, I am having to smelt a load of cobblestone so as I can get some smooth stone, so as I can craft some stone bricks, so as I can craft stone brick slabs. So this is me being totally unprepared for the task at which I've arrived. Uh, that is not uncommon. Now I could go and use the smooth stone generator that's over there and generate myself some smooth stone. But look, I've not got a silk touch pick, which means that I'm just gonna be generating cobblestone, which I'm probably gonna have to do because I've not got enough cobblestone i probably have got enough cobblestone to be fair to be able to make what i need to make so i've basically got to improve my planning but i'm going to get this roof done if it kills me so what i've done here just to like i've put in kind of the little archway right behind it i've got obviously the doors that i just walked through we've got a little bit of lighting behind those stairs there so that closes that off that lighting is kind of covered underneath so as it's not kind of in your face and then i've put trap doors over these little bits here just to make them slightly less kind of oomphy i've put yeah look at this i've actually put polished polished not just any but would you believe it look i've got polished andesite i've actually used i, I did bring i did bring polished granite but i decided i wouldn't wouldn't use it because it's horrible <laughs> but i did use polished andesite and you should be very proud of me that i used a polished stone type in this build it is not something you see very often but i do oh, will you please come and hurry up i need to make more stuff but basically all i've got to do is just keep making stone brick so i can make some stone brick slabs like that and also need some extra stone brick and some stone brick stairs as well then i can start to make the roof and it will start to look lovely i hope so i'm back over in the desert because i reckon you can just see it in the background i reckon i've just started the roof and i think i need some glass and i've only got 58 blocks of glass which i thought would be stacks uh well nearly one stack anyway and i thought that would be plenty but of course i was positively wrong i think i want a bit more than this not not loads more maybe just another stack of glass ish but that means that i need to smelt up a load of sand so have I, how much sand have i got now i've got yeah uh, uh yeah that should be enough i reckon so let's just get myself back over and you can see what i mean when i get here look i've made this kind of row thing all the way around there you can see it and um i think i'm going to put some glass in behind it because i think i think i think that might be the best thing to do with it so what i need to do is i need to yeah you'll do let's just start smelting up this get that out i'm gonna have to do some more wood and i um there we go. That's has that got enough to do all of those three, and then I can use that fuel to do the rest. Um, yeah, why not? Let's do that. Right, so let's come up here. So if I come up this side here, oh, he's blown it. When even stood on top of it. What kind of amateur are you, man? Right. So what I want to do is I want to get the glass. I think in here. 
Now I've got to get it right because I've not got my silk touch pick. So we're going to do it there. That way it's indented to the roof, but is still creating the barrier, which is what I want, so as it doesn't look like it's kind of got all gappy, because gappy is not what we're after. Um, I'm really making this up as I go along. I had zero plans. And again, unusual for me to have zero plans of what it was I was going to build. I knew what I wanted to build, but I didn't know how I was going to build it. I thought, you know, you can wing it. You do this winging thing all the time. So I'm basically winging it, like I say. And I am almost, look, I almost had enough. Look, two bits of glass and I'd have been there. Can I reach? Yes, I can. Ho ho. There we go. So there and there. Got it all the way around. Yes, I do. So I can take that out. Plenty of glass. Um, so let's do one more since so I've got eight bits of glass. That'd be quite useful. Um, we were going in that one. And that's just got a load of charcoal. So let's lob that back in there. And then I can just make more block, which allows me to make more slabbage. And we can start to put a bit more slabbage on. Oh, it's, it's not never already bedtime again. Right, well, I better go to sleep because this is my fourth night in a row not sleeping and I do not want to get phantomed. So I'll be back when I've had a bit of a zuz. Right, we are nearly there. I do, however, because I've just got this indent here. And what I want to do with this indent is um, kind of replace, because I had to take out those trees that were in the way. So I'm going to replace the, the dirt so as we can put some pretty flowers back in there as well, because otherwise Wild will get terribly upset if she can't do the flower thing. Have I got, actually, have I got any bone meal? Let me just have a look. Have I got any bone meal? Or have I got any bones? Uh, no. Have I got to go skelly hunting? What I thought is if I had some bone meal, I could have done the bone meal trick on the flowers there and put them along there. That would have been quite good, but I haven't got any. So that's not gonna work, is it? Right, well, maybe I'll find some skellies or drop some bones and I'll be able to get a couple of flowers during the night. Mm. Possibly, possibly they do sit, tend to spawn and it is, night is, night time is coming, a bit like winter is coming. So let's put a little bit more detail on here because this is too bland for my liking. Let's put some little buttons all around the sides of these at that level. Give it a bit more, a bit more interest, I think. Shove that in there. That no, not there. But is that where I wanted to put it? No, I wanted to put it there. Is that the right place? Yeah, it is the right place. Oh. Almost fluffed it again. Right, that goes there. And goes there. And that should be all of the way around. And I think I probably want to do a little bit of something inside here as well. So I'm just going to put a button of decoration all the way around on these. Just to make it look a little bit more, I don't know, interesting. Um, I wonder if I could put, have I got anything on top of that? Hang on, experiment time, where's my, if I put that on top of there, does that look daft? Um, mm, debatable, I'm, I'm gonna say no, I think that's not working for me. And so I've put, got all of these furnaces in not really for functionality to be honest they're in there because what says industrial more than the odd furnace that's what i thought and um we've got plenty of lights so we're not going to get any mob spawning in here we've got everyone's thing i've got a few bare walls which i mean maybe we can fill up over time let's get i've not used any of the iron blocks that i made which is about right isn't it so let's just lob a load of this stuff back in here i'm gonna all night is falling. 
if I can get rid of those. Have we got any skellies? Come on, skellies. Let's see if we can have a little piece of you, shall we? I would like... Yeah, I've got room. I would like to... Oh, no, there's where I've busted other people's chops open. I would like some bonage. So where are you, skelly? I don't need much. I just need three or four bones. I reckon that would be enough. Oh, there's a creeper there, though. That ain't a cactus. There you go. You can't hide from me. That was a little bit naughty. Come on, skeletons. But why is it when you don't want to come across... Oh, my goodness. When you don't want to come across a skelly, there are hundreds of them. But when you do, there's not a one. You can go away. You can definitely go away. Come what, what else? I didn't see you creeping up then. That was a bit naughty. Oh, here comes the baby to make my day bad. Oh, for goodness sake. Right, so I'm going to run back this way. Because I need to ref... Look at that. Oh, and there's the skellies. When I don't want them, they're there. What did I just tell you? When you don't want a skelly... How have they got on top? Oh, there's a creeper there as well. This is... This hard mode, Lark. I'll tell you what. We don't want none of that. Right, so let's come this way. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Right, so now I need to recharge myself. Where's me food? There's me food. Oh, that almost went horribly wrong, didn't it? Oh, no, the baby's there again. You've been chasing me, you little monkey. Yeah, that's what you get for chasing me. Oh, shoot you in the face. Right, now I've got to go and find... Oh, look, now we've got a baby skelly wearing armour. And a big skelly wearing armour. Oh, my God. That guy's just got a little bit over the top there, didn't it? For goodness sake. Why am that creeper? Did I kill it? I don't think I did. I wonder if, because all of these mobs are here, I wonder if that's why none of the... Look, oh, they just keep coming. I wonder if that's why none of the um, mobs are spawning in my farm. Oh, and have we got spiders at it as well? Look, it's even got arachnids giving it large on me. Right, so come on. You can go away. I just want some skeletonage. Oh, it's a good job I've got an infinity bow, isn't it? Otherwise I'd have been in right trouble. Whoa, creepage. You can go away. 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 Yeah, like that. That's what you get. And you can go away. And now I'm going to eat something. I'm exhausted. And I don't even get the skelly. Look, it's there. Now I did. Look, the creeper's come in. Creeper's having a piece of me as well. Oh, this is getting a bit frantic. Right, have I got... Whoa! <laughs> right. Oh, my goodness. Get out of the way. Run away. Run away, as they say in Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Right. Come on. What a... Shoot you in the face. Oh, my goodness. I'm properly exhausted. You can go away, you nasty arachnid person. Oh, now you want a piece of me as well. Oh. Oh, I've got lag. The lag's going to do me. Oh, the lag's going to do me. It's, I'm going to get done by lag. Of all the things to get done by, I'm going to get done by lag. Quick eat. Quick, 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 quick. Hide. Hide like the coward that you are. And kill him from around the corner. Oh, I only wanted a few bones. <laughs> oh, dear. Why are you not picking up the bones? Did I pick up the bones? Uh, I got five bones. I reckon that. I, this is ridiculous. Look at me. I'm peppered. I'm absolutely peppered. This is, it's only a flesh wound. I promise you it's only fine. I, I, I feel weak. I feel weak. Oh, Mr. Mannering. Right, come on. Get get yourself inside. Protect yourself, man. 
I don't know how there's stuff on top there. I guess there's it's not um, light enough on top there. But now what I can do is I can get this bone. I can get myself plenty of bone meal. I can eat this. Return my heart. My heart's going like a nutcase. Oh my goodness. Right, come on. Get out there. Go on. Be, be brave, boy. Be brave. Right, so I just want some of these. Are they the only flowers we've got or are there different types of flowers up this end? Let's just have a quick goosey over here. We have it's the same flowers, but that's all good. I'll get those. Right, so that's given me six. I think that's right. I think that's right. So let's come over here and plant myself up. Have I got some... Right, I might as well have my XP orbs. Goodness knows I've earned them. There we go. If I come back. Where's where's me? There it is. Right, so if I plant up. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Perfect. Look at that. I couldn't have planned it better. Right, so you're annoying me just because you're undead. Oh. And you, go on. Go away. I've had enough for you. Come on, get out of the way. Right, I might have to retreat. I can't take any more. I'm going to get that creeper there, though. There you go. He's dropped a spud. There's another creeper there, look. Shoot him through the grass. And, of course, there's an enderman. Oh, I'll get him in the back. There's nothing cowardly about that, right? Oh, goodness me. Oh, look, they're coming up behind me now, look. Let's have the arachnid as well. Oh, he's coming. Creep, don't try and hide behind the pig. It's not a porky place to hide. Oh, no. That poor pig. Let's collect everything up. Did, I was only meant to be building a post office, not fighting off the undead. Goodness me. Right, right. That's the entire night. I've just been giving it some smack on the on the undead and the creeperage, and I almost died. And all I wanted to do was build a post office. Oh dear. Anyway, I ran with just about there. So I thought I'd do a quick sweeping flyby, just to see the the finished product. So there we go. We got a little bit of not a little bit, a very definitely big bit. A big bit of post officeage um, right here that we can now send each other items or messages or whatever it might be right on there. And I think that's... Let's waste some rockets and go and have a flyby. Why not? Um, and then we can you know, basically give each other like a, like a proper post office. There you go. It's industrial-ish, kind of. It's about as industrious as I've ever built, that's for sure. Um, and I think that looks all right. I'm quite happy. There we go. Gracefully diving in. And one post office. Let's go inside. I know you've already seen it. But we've got... I need to collect up all my bits and pieces. Not leave them there. But we've got... Everybody's got their um, post box. So one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine. All of us got one. And we can start sending each other messages left, right, and center. So I reckon I'm going to call that a day there. I'm, I think I need holiday, let alone a sleep. Goodness me, that was more than I was expecting that last night. Goodness. Right, anyway, I think that came out okay. Now, come on, Alphas. Send each other some lovely messages saying how much you love to play with them on this server. And I'm sure we will all have a happy time get that inside you right if you've enjoyed this video please do remember to slap that like button also if you've not done it already please do remember to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell it'll be great to see you in my sub club and i look forward to seeing you in another video you take it easy now bye